Hello, welcome, and thank you very much for listening to this talk. My name is Leo Stolarov, and I'm an engineering director here at KPMG. KPMG is a global network of professional services firms providing audit, tax, and advisory services. And technology is at the heart of everything we do and part of the very DNA of our business. Specifically, our engineering business at KPMG UK builds and runs cutting-edge solutions for clients all across the world using the latest technology. With skills across cloud engineering, software development, and automation, we act as a focal point, delivering high-quality services that support businesses to innovate and address a variety of complex challenges. I personally love collaborating with people on complex problems and enabling big ideas through code. Today, I'll talk about how enterprises can manage risk and meet compliance requirements while accelerating the pace of delivery of business initiatives. If you're a developer, I hope you take away how automation can empower engineers to build more secure software. If you're a security professional, I'll demonstrate how security and compliance policies can be automated to provide developers immediate and actionable feedback. And if you manage sets of technology teams, I will aim to demonstrate how those teams can accelerate the delivery of projects and innovations without introducing additional risk to your business. The technology landscape continues to evolve quickly. At the same time, organizations are also expected to ship technology features faster than ever. And there are currently three significant security-related challenges that are facing the tech industry. Firstly, developers and security teams remain siloed, and most developers are not empowered with the required security knowledge to address security themselves. Secondly, there is an application security skill gap and a growing developer shortage. According to US labor statistics, as of December 2020, the global talent shortage amounted to 40 million skilled workers worldwide. By 2030, the global talent shortage is expected to reach 85 million. Companies worldwide the risk losing more than $8 trillion in revenue because of the lack of skilled talent. Finally, traditional ways of meeting an organization's security and compliance requirements negatively impact developer workflow and productivity. These challenges and current high demand for technology talent highlight the need for healthy and effective engineering practices to motivate and retain talent and to deliver productive engineering outcomes. It is essential to create an environment in which developers can be effective, where they can use their time well, applying their energy and creativity to build valuable working software for their users. And optimizing developer effectiveness involves improving the core feedback loops that developers and teams experience, such as time to launch service, time to productivity for new employees, and and other quality measures of developer satisfaction. We will zoom in on approaches organizations can take to embed security into development practices. I'll discuss how KPMG empowers teams to securely and rapidly innovate on software and customer experiences that drive business results and maximize developer effectiveness. KPMG uses GitHub Enterprise Cloud to boost collaboration and sharing among its many member firms. Due to our member firm structure, GitHub Enterprise Cloud allows us to delegate the appropriate level of control of organizations' administration down to individual member firms while still being able to collaborate through internal repositories. In order to achieve that, we needed to give secure administration patterns for member firms to adopt and have heavily relied on existing code-driven approaches such as uh, safe settings projects and many others. We also needed to put in place a mechanism to legally share code across organizations. And this has led us to create a few KPMG MIT style license types. This is how the KPMG code platform was born. It is our internal initiative to unite our developers on a single engineering platform. We use this platform to inner source, standardize our engineering practices, tear down barriers, and improve team communication and collaboration. Our recommendation to other organizations is to focus on creating a culture that embraces automation, so automating as much as possible and streamlining what is not, encourages curiosity and learning, and invests in secure DevOps practices to save time in the long term. This focus will allow engineers to ship code features quicker and make the organization more competitive. Writing code faster is great, but that needs to come with the ability to mitigate constant software security risks. And traditional approaches to managing security risks, such as 
manual point-in-time assessments combined with often cumbersome and outdated controls can lead to delays in delivering value and uh, cause significant friction between information security and engineering. One way to reduce this friction while ensuring that you can securely deliver value through technology is productizing security and introducing it earlier into your software development life cycle. In other words, you should start to treat your security policy as an integral part of cold production. Taking this approach, we at KPMG UK were able to automate many of our compliance checks. And of course, GitHub Actions and GitHub Advanced Security became extremely powerful tools for achieving this. Previously, security checks would happen late in the product development lifecycle, burdening engineers to fix problems long after they thought they were finished writing code. In addition, most security tools were built for security professionals, not for software developers. Now, GitHub Advanced Security allows us to consistently automate our security and compliance posture and provide immediate feedback to developers. GitHub had made it easy to spot compliance issues and vulnerabilities in our code and dependencies early in the software development lifecycle before any code is even shipped. In addition, interacting with a single portal throughout the lifecycle has reduced context switching and toil for developers and now enables them to remediate these vulnerabilities quickly through automatically generated pull requests. Today, KPMG UK manages risks at an enterprise level with GitHub Advanced Security using tools like Dependabot, CodeQL, secret scanning with push protection, and GitHub Actions. Dependabot offers insight into the state of KPMG security, allowing us to identify and prioritize dependency vulnerabilities. CodeQL provides us with a wealth of pre-written CodeQL queries, and it was effortless for KPMG to get started out of the box. In a matter of minutes, we can plug in a CodeQL pack for Python, and even write some custom queries for one of the high-profile projects. Secret scanning with push protection ensures that our repositories are secure and free from secrets. Now, GitHub Advanced Security automatically ensures that KPMG developers do not unknowingly commit credentials to a code base. In KPMG UK, we have also built custom automation with GitHub Actions to check projects' compliance with the company's security policies. This has allowed us to give developers immediate feedback on code checked in and whether they are stepping outside KPMG security or compliance boundaries. This approach provides an instant feedback loop to the developers, making it an extremely effective way of building security early in the development process. This action works by evaluating repository contents against a policy described in the YAML file. This policy explains what dependency license types are approved for use, which types should be consumed with additional due diligence, and which are completely prohibited. The policy also states remediation timeframes for different severities of vulnerabilities to give teams an appropriate timeline to remediate them. Ultimately, it provides developers immediate guidance on security or compliance controls they need to focus on. The vision for this action is that it will be automatically rolled out to every new repository and constantly kept up to date across more than 6,000 existing repositories in our enterprise across the global network. Crucially, this approach maintains central visibility that provides assurance that we as an organization are secure and not exposing ourselves to unnecessary risks without impeding any developer workflows. Today, my call to action is to make security and risk management proactive and productize the implementation. To achieve that, focus on empowering developers. Developers need tools embedded directly into the developer workflow that enables them to quickly and seamlessly secure their code in minutes. And the beauty of productizing security is that you don't have to trade off the developer experience. When you make security consumable to your developers, it's easy to comply and manage risk at pace and scale. Risk management at KPMG was historically cumbersome and various departments also performed manual security quality assurance, leading to a lengthy and time-consuming process. KPMG UK needed a security platform that would continue safeguarding customer trust while simultaneously providing an easy-to-use development environment. So we chose to adopt and standardize on GitHub Advanced Security. Standardizing on GitHub Advanced Security has meant that developers have fewer tools to juggle, which reduces their cognitive load and lets them focus on innovating. The key to this shift was for us to start thinking about security as a product that KPMG security teams deliver to developers, rather than a series of tasks to be conducted after functionality has already been produced. To summarize, I will leave you with two key takeaways. 
First takeaway is that in order to reduce friction between developers and security, think of security and compliance as a product that serves developers and not just a set of policies. By treating security as a product with a dedicated set of engineers and product owners, you can start to offer this as a service to your engineering and risk functions. Another way to describe it is as a golden path or a paved road analogy. Your goal is to lower the barrier of entry to securing code as much as possible. The second is you can turn security and compliance into products by embracing tools like GitHub Actions and GitHub Advanced Security that will make compliance automatic where possible and surface issues early in the process when they're easiest to fix. Thank you very much for listening to this talk about how to empower your teams to manage risk at scale. 